Welcome to Crazy Sounds 10 Minutes or Less. I'm Jonas. And I'm TNT9. I'm, I'm starting the timer. You can't see it. it <laughs> it's really just, you know, it's a trust exercise at this point. <laughs> Boom. So, TNT, your mans, Jesse Smollett. <laughs> My mans. <laughs> we're, we finally have the final update on Smollett. <laughs> My man, he says. This, uh, this goes back a few seasons, man. So, did you see that Smollett was finally sentenced? Did you see this? Uh, yeah, I so saw he got sentenced. I don't know how long. Or did you watch the video or anything? Um, I mean, I know he, I know he was like, I did not do this, Your Honor. I respect you and the jail time. He but started I, screaming I, that he was not suicidal. Yeah. Oh, yeah. What was that? So he was like, what Yeah. What was he, that? He goes, Just so you guys know, I am not suicidal. Yeah, like, I am what? innocent. <laughs> I like, am what, not. Does he think he's going to be killed or something? Yeah, essentially, like, yeah, I guess he assumed that he's going to be Epstein in the prison. Like, is he that out of touch with like? <laughs> is he that out? Like, who's going to kill you, bro? Like, you committed a hate crime on yourself to gain notoriety. Have been found guilty. There's hard proof that you did it. You lied, yeah, yeah. and you're still saying you're innocent, and now you're, like, going to be martyred by... Mur- they're going to murder you in prison, and you're 150 days in jail or whatever? <laughs> like, what the hell is wrong with that man, dude? Dude, I don't know. Um, uh, He was a famous TV actor. He was... He, he had he the life. semi-famous. I mean, but, semi-famous. But, right, but he yeah. had the life, dude. He, he, he made it as a TV star. He wasn't the main character, but he was making money, and he was on shows. He wanted more. He wanted and, to be the victim of a hate crime. And what happens is when people want more, they'll do anything to get more. I saw something interesting on Reddit the other day where, like, uh, there's always the people have the question of, like, uh, how many times would you press a button that uh, killed somebody if it gave you a billion dollars? A billion? Yeah. Okay. Or even a million dollars. Right, right, right. It doesn't really matter. It, it a million dollars in every time you press a button to kill, to kill Random a Random person. person. So it could be yeah. your mom, but it could be some dude or some person. And they were talking about how, like, essentially to get that kind of money, like, a lot of these billionaires are kind of doing that because... You know, like to me. Oh, yeah, you're running to, over people. To, yeah, you're running over people. You're getting people fired from their job. Like, butterfly bankrupting effect. other country, companies that people are employed. Exactly. Yeah. And the people, yeah, they. Exactly. Butterfly effect, you are essentially causing turmoil in somebody's lives because you got your hands in so many different pots and your tendrils reach across so many different uh, life lifespans. Right. Um, just because, you know. That's the the nature of the beast of him of being a millionaire. So in in this in this case, it's just kind of like yeah. He thought that he if he thought. did this, he would it would propel him yeah. even higher in fame because he was now the victim of a hate crime. So he made it because I think he wanted to show that look, I made it, and I'm still a victim of racism and hate crimes yeah. and all this stuff, and ended up like. Who wasn't what the police weren't gonna look, weren't gonna look into that? Bro, hey, look, if you're not cheating, you're not trying. I'm not condoning this behavior, but if you're not cheating, you're not trying. I mean, right? yeah, dude. I guess, and that's the thing. I guess, I guess, I can relate a, a little bit with like you were talking about the billionaires, uh, with like you know back when when you're young, like you don't have any money, you you aren't able to save any money, you're making crap. But like when you get a little older and you make a little more, and like and you're able to like save a lot, of, like not even a lot of money, just you're like, oh, I have, I, you know, remember like the, the first time you're like, oh man, I have a thousand dollars in savings. <laughs> then all of a sudden you're like, oh dude, I got like fifteen hundred bucks saved up, and you're like, man. And then like if you if you save up and you have like a little bit more, you're like, wow, it kind of feels good to have some money saved up, you know. And then like I could see being a millionaire and being like, can I get to ten million? Oh, yeah. Can it get to hundred million? Making money is addictive, apparently. Um, yeah, extremely, and especially fame, notoriety, man. Just if 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 we were to walk through the streets and people were to like say, "Hey, there's Jonas," or "Hey, there's TNT Dynamite," you know, like that would feel great. So it can be it can be a drug. It can be a drug. Yeah, and yeah. I guess just like any drug, if maybe he just didn't feel like he was important enough at that moment. Oh, he's absolutely like, not. He how can big role. I think they were even supposed to uh, end his character on, uh, I think he was on Power. I think they were supposed to end his oh, character. Oh, Empire. Empire, yeah. That's oh, like it. his character was going to get murdered or yeah. written off or something. So yeah. he knew his time was coming to an end. Oh, and, and I believe that's what happened to his character, too. Well, after. I mean, that they just had to, had to speed that up a little bit. Yeah, because he's out there acting up, man. So, yeah, it's a shame, man. So, you know... um, 
as as the black person in the room, uh, I'm going to have to say is that we are canceling a ju- juicy Smolier. They're taking away his t- his uh, key card oh, to the mothership. Oh, no, dude, yeah, yeah, he can't he can't get on the holodeck. On the, on the he, he puts his he puts his car goes. Yeah, he can't get in. He can't. No, no, he's not invited to the mothership cookout that's happening. <laughs> By the way, Jodeci performing at the mothership Jodeci. cookout. If you wonder what the mothership cookout, I, me and Jonas make this joke about there being a black mothership and a white mothership. <laughs> And there's certain things that I can't say about black people on the on the program because <laughs> the mothership will like come and find me. Revoke your access. Yeah. <laughs> and if Jonas says certain things, then the white mothership will come and pick him up and I'll be like, "What the hell are you doing down there, Jonas?" <laughs> <laughs> so that's that's why we make the mothership jokes. So. The mothership cookout. <laughs> so yeah, Jesse Smollett. Jonas performing at the mothership. <laughs> Of all bands, Jodeci. <laughs> We're reuniting them at the Mothership. Hey, man. yo, if any, if there's anywhere Jodeci could perform, it'd be on the Black Mothership. That makes I'm sense. You right yeah. now. Yeah, I guess yeah. so. Just... We got the NKOTB reunion on the Black oh, Mothership, dude. No, come on. You'd have, <laughs> you'd have somebody good on the, on the White Mothership. Who would we uh, we reunite Led Zeppelin? Like, uh, Billy Crystal? I mean, <laughs> Billy Crystal. <laughs> Billy <laughs> Crystal sings the hits. <laughs> sings NKOTB songs. I meant, uh, I meant uh, Billy. He does a podcast with Obama. What? Bruce Springsteen. Oh, Bruce Springsteen. Yeah, oh, God. He would be on the way. Mothership, dude. Yeah, dude. Can I skip that cookout? <laughs> Why? I'd go to the white mothership any day, dude. I'd hang out. I yeah, man. I can't get behind all the doors. So, I mean, know. essentially the whole point of all this is don't commit hate crimes on yourself. That's a good idea. <laughs> White, black, Hispanic, don't commit hate crimes. Don't commit period. crimes. How about that? Yeah, yeah, yeah. How about I, just stop committing crimes? Yeah, that would be nice. I don't know. Yeah, I don't know, man. I guess, like, you know, once you're... And the thing is, is that he's such an actor, too. I've, I've always had this one issue with actors, Jonas. It seems like if you were to date an actor or if you were to do business with an actor, like a person who's going to acting school and like has an established career as an actor or Broadway yeah. or whatever, it seems like it'd be difficult to know when they're being genuine and when they're not being I genuine. I mean, we're technically actors. We have improv experience. Uh, yeah. If anyone's... If that's that's like the realest acting there is because it's all off the top of your head. And I mean, I give you that. Everybody acts to a certain extent in their life, but it seems like actors, like these these are people who live in roles for hours and hours and hours. Or yeah, or months, a, y- a months. year straight because they have to film a movie or whatever. And then whatever. the idea of like a method actor, somebody who has to like, I need to get into the role like a Jim Carrey. And that's yeah. what they are for the whole time they're... Exactly. It takes a certain degree of, I, I think, in, <laughs> like you have to break yourself mentally from what would be like the status quo or norm of being a human to method. Act, yeah, I think I think anybody who's an actor is a little bit insane. Yeah, 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 I'm just saying. Yeah. It seems a little weird to me, but. Yeah, dude, I don't know. I couldn't imagine like being like, you know, like they say, especially if you're doing something like they say, like Heath Ledger and the Joker. Yeah. Like, you know what I mean? Like putting yourself in that sort of mindset for so – it has to affect you as a human, right? It has to, man. So, you know, Jesse Smollett might have might maybe he was, some of that. Maybe he was the uh, the nephew of the tycoon of the mogul of the rap family on Empire, and he just took it to heart, and he just wanted to be a sleazy person. That's 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 one idea. <laughs> Who that's knows? one idea. We, Anyways, you know that's all time we have for today's episode. Please make sure to go to thecrazytown.com and subscribe. For Jonas. T.U.T. Uh, we are out.